I don't know my feelings, Philly. So, here is another one of those vlogs in which I talk about multiple subjects. Uh, first up is about a blog that I've written um, only a few days ago. And I want to share these three wisdoms I talk about in this blog. Now, I call them wisdoms because they're very useful in life and it's upon hearing them that you don't understand them from the get-go you hear them and you need experience to understand them you need to have tried to search the wisdom in the knowledge that these wisdoms give you um, so these three wisdoms I will cover them only shortly because this is a vlog in which I try to tackle multiple subjects um, but you can read the entire blog in the description box down below, there's a link there. Um, so the first one, you control your own mindset. And I think this is very important. Um, by this I mean to say that if you want to feel happy, if you want to be optimistic, you can be, you can feel like that. And it's true that we can go through difficult times and yes you can experience great pain however you can also choose to stay to stay feeling that pain or you can choose to move on and I'm not saying that controlling your mindset is easy however if you really try it if you really go for it you will see that there's a whole different world out there um, the second wisdom, think and think critically. And if you have the time, do your own research. And I think this is really the most important one, because if you don't think and you don't think for yourself, then how are you going to understand the world? You're only going to see it from your own perspective, and you're not going to get new insights, which really is something you want, because understanding these wisdoms will make your life easier and no thinking means that you will probably not understand these wisdoms um, the third one if you want to see change start by making it yourself on whatever scale you feel is possible and this is something you hear a lot you know if you want to change the world um, start by making the change yourself and you hear that and you start thinking well how about other people because I can I can change I can make some things change but if other, if other people don't change then what does it really matter well the thing is when you make change when you see the change you make you really are already making change and that is the thing that matters not the thing what is happening around you. Um, so again, um, the link to that blog is down in the description box if you would like to read it. Um, now, for another subject, the litter video and the genuine small project video I feel are very wonderful videos in uh, in their concepts and I would really love to make more of these kind of videos but I simply have no ideas so if you do have one but you don't have the time to make one of these videos then I will make such a video and I will credit you for it of course um, or I could make it for you and I could um, send it to you through mail so that you can upload it to your own channel um, the thing is, I just want to make these videos because I see what appreciation they get and I see that these videos for me mean so much more than the vlogs I make and the guitar videos I used to make and although there's still one uh, guitar video in the planning that I really should do because I promised I would do it a long time ago and I still haven't done it there's still one guitar video I have to do. Um, you know, these, the these positivity videos, they are just 
so much more meaningful. And uh, yeah, so I'm looking forward to do one of those again. Also, I still have to work on a new song for the Genuine Smile project because I'm planning to make a song and then make an announcement video that there might be another 2012 Genuine Smile project video if people are willing to participate and if they like the song. Um, the idea is this, they already hear the song so they know um, the song they will get and if they like the song they might want to participate and the problem was with the previous video was that I feel the, the Calm Edition was not good enough in quality in terms of um, the song so that's why I now want to change and make the song first and after that the video uh, which for 2013 might mean that there might be a choice between multiple songs but just depends on what I do if I have the time for it and if I have the creative mindset for it to make the right kind of song um, so yeah that about positivity videos now one subject I keep um, talking about time and time again is religion and now once more I will do so because this person has been contacting me through YouTube and he's been really uh, kind of attacking me about me not being religious and me not uh, being able to lead a happy life and not being able to go to heaven if I don't turn Muslim um, and you know what I said to him was this well if you are a good human and um, you do good you have good intentions you live in the now and you do what matters to the people around you and you don't act selfish you don't act arrogant then if there's a God he will accept you into heaven and if he won't if he really insists that you pray for him and that you um, worship him then I think he really is a very bad being indeed and I say this because you know praying worshiping that's all just wasted time we live in the now what we do now matters and when we go to heaven we can serve God if we want but now what really matters is that we serve each other, that we help each other out because we can't see God, we can't hear Him, we have no evidence of Him existing now if He really wanted us to pray for Him to be there for Him, to do whatever for Him then He would give a clear sign that He does exist but no such sign exists and therefore, you know, we should just live to help out each other and live to grow ourselves so yeah and also this other thing about religion is creation and what I find interesting and I only realized this like a week ago um, people ask themselves how did it all begin but the problem with that is we don't know whether there was a point of nothingness, whether there was a time in which there was nothing and whether there really was a creation. Maybe everything just simply was and it just grew, it just changed, but maybe there never really was a point of creation. Now this is a philosophical um, thing but you know still it's really good to think about this to realize that we don't know how it all started if it started at all we just know that it is that we are here and we know a little bit about our history because things were recorded by 
preview human beings but even still about those recordings, recordings from previous human beings we don't know how correct they are now another thing about creation is this you cannot assume that out of nothingness something was created if you want to say well nothing suddenly existed and therefore there had to be something that is not the way of saying there was nothing and out of nothing there was something created which is something that religion does it says well first there was nothing but there was God and that you know that doesn't really go together you cannot invent a God to solve the solution of there being nothing um, but there's another solution and that is energy because to my knowledge that's the only thing that doesn't get lost doesn't get made and is everlasting so at the point of creation it would be logic to me that at first there was only energy and it was so compact together that it just was too chaotic and it would burst out at some point and the way that might uh, happen might be like an explosion and then because there were limits to the space it would implode again and then faster explode and implode even faster until it would explode with so much strength that something had to be created that energy created something which would mean that energy is a creator now you could also if you're really insisting on there being God you could also assume well this energy created a God who then created the world to his likings however then still energy is the creator um, so long enough a video and um, I hope you enjoyed it and if you want me to tackle subjects as just one per video let me know because this is what works for me but it might not work for you and I simply you know, I accept these longer vlogs and I like to watch them now and then but you might not um, so yeah anyway let me know and thank you for watching and see you next time